How to use the font creator. Start by preparing image data for each character you want. Launch the font creator of the PE design next. We'll select a capital A from the Home tab. Select Open from the View tab. Click Select Image File. Select the image for the capital A to load the data. Once the image is loaded, we can adjust the height of the letter. Drag the A so that the top is at the capital line and the bottom is at the base line. Next, adjust the position of the red set line to indicate the amount of space you want between characters. When you are finished adjusting, reduce the density of the character image display so that it doesn't lose clarity during digitizing. Go to the Home tab. Digitize the character so that the entry point is at the bottom left and the exit point is at the bottom right. If we check Preview Window in the View tab, we can see how the stitches will appear. Let's make a lowercase g next. We'll start by selecting it. As before, the system will load the character image. The baseline of the lowercase g needs to extend below the baseline of the capital A from before. So let's adjust the size and positioning of the letter so that it falls in the right position. Now, we'll digitize the character so that the entry point is at the bottom left and the exit point is at the bottom right. We'll follow the same procedure to digitize a lowercase r and a lowercase e. Once all four letters are digitized, select Save from the System menu. We'll save the font as My Agree in the My Font folder. Launch the layout and editing. Select the Text tool to display the font list. Scroll down to find My Agree. If we select it, we can now create embroidered letter strings using this font.